Here's what happened. In 1969, Martin Luther, that's when the he, his assassination. Mm -hmm. When the next year, which was in '70, I went into the office and I told him, I says, I won't be to work on Martin Luther King's day. There ain't no such day. I said, because Kentucky did not recognize it, but there is a day. And I won't be here. Well, you're going to pay for it. We're going to take it out of your salary. I said, well, do it. I, I, I won't be here. And uh, I got enough leave time. I got enough comp time, or anything you want. I said, but I'm not working today. And I went home. And so the director of instruction, who was over us, the guy that I had, that all oh, had this, he just had a fit. You a bad example for my staff, and I said, well, write it up, mail it somewhere. And then after that, I start working towards getting a, making it a holiday. I wanted to make the people of Kentucky conscious. Now, was it already a holiday in other states? Yeah. Okay. It's true. Uh, not true. They were working on it, and it, they all the states, but Kentucky was next to the last state. To, you know, we I, it took me twenty years, almost. You worked on that project for twenty years, Mr. Logan. Almost. It was. See, Wilkerson mm -hmm. signed the bill. See, Governor, I, Governor Wilkerson? Governor Wilkerson. Mm -hmm. And he gave me the first copy. Mm -hmm. And, uh, see, I, I, came, I, I went to the work there in the department. I went on the five governors. None was the governor when I started to work. And Wilkinson was the governor that I left under. 